ASAP, ASAP, ASAP. ASAP, ASAP, ASAP. Hey, what's up? This is Champ Swap from Swap Productions, and I'm going to talk a little bit about Google Chrome today. Um, believe it or not, this is my third time trying to make this. I'm having problems today, so bear with me here. Um, so, when you first look at it, it really looks nice. I really like it. It's not no blocky looking at it. I like the curves and the newer looking style. So, so far, I really like it. And really nice and hopefully they'll be able to you'll be able to customize it I mean be able to change this blue into have like a picture of a dragon on top or something that'd be kind of cool um, maybe that's something they would do but I don't know hopefully that ha would happen so so far I mean it's been working great for me but. so when you first you have most of this is the site basically your history and pictures so you can kind of look and just click on it and you will go to where that site so I mean you can open it up click you do one click and you're on my space or one click you're on uh, YouTube <coughs> that fast it's a really nice feature I really like it and I think probably all other internet browsers will definitely use that so I mean also, this address bar here is a little bit different too. Um, if you type in like something like this, if you type in iPhone or so, it will give you websites like Apple.com, Wireless AT&T, and all that stuff. But if you hit Enter, oh my bad, Enter, it will search through Google or whatever you set it up as. You can set up as Yahoo, MSN, whatever you want. So I mean that's a lot faster too. You can just type whatever you want here. Just type it in, hit enter, and you're already searching through Google that fast. It's really nice, a real nice feature. I think other internet browsers will take that up too. Um, also another great thing is you can add you know, tabs right here. Just hit the plus, and it'll bring in a tab. So, and then for it says right here, for quick access, place your bookmarks here in the bookmarks bar. Right there. So, it's really, really nice. You can add bookmarks up here, I guess. I didn't know that. So, I learned something. I learned something new every day. So, if you have a new tab, you can go like here, go to YouTube or something. And so, whenever you have a new tab, there's something you can do. I mean, have you ever wanted something in its own window for some reason? And you have to re minimize, open it up, or just click File New Window. And then you have to retype in or do whatever, copy the address bar, or whatever. Now it's a lot different. You know, let's say if I want this in its own window. I just drag it over here, like so, and then let go, and there we go, got a whole new window for that, and let's say if I want to put it back for some reason, you just drag it, you can put it back, and it's back in here, and you can change these now, so if you want this one in front of that one instead for some reason, there you go, so I mean it's really up to you or however you want it. I mean you can organize your tabs, you can add tabs, take tabs into their own windows or so on and so on. It's a really great feature. I really like it and I think almost any almost all the other browsers will use it because it's a great feature too. Um, so also they have let's see here if you go to this little button here and click on it, you have this right here. If you can read that. So, um, 
basically what this does is whatever you search in here, nobody will ever know that you've been to that site. So it's basically kind of like a porno window, basically is what you can call it. Um, I mean, you can type do your whatever, do your business here, and then nobody will ever know, basically, because it don't save anything. It don't save your history, your cookies, or anything like that. So it's really it's a good feature, and parents might not like it, but yeah. Um, and then right here it tells you what it does, and this last one is really funny. You should definitely read that. Pretty funny. Download it and read it. I'm not going to zoom in. You'll laugh when you see it, probably. It's pretty funny. The second rule, the bottom two are funny. So, yeah, and you can do the same thing with tabs and all that stuff. In this. So, that works out. Um, what else can you do? Um, and no, I'm not really. Oh, okay. There's my. Um, right here you can click the add bookmark in the back. And if you hold it, you can show your full history and stuff. It's, I, I really like this. It's probably one of the best browsers. Well, it ain't the best yet because it's only a beta version, but it's really up there. I like the layout and stuff. It's really nice. Um, well, uh, that's about it. That's all I can think. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, and if you want me to do videos about Photoshop or computer programs or let's see what uh, um, I can do. Sony Vegas, basically whatever I can do a lot and try to teach you or whatever. So just oh yeah, I don't think I mentioned this. And so far, when the only problem I experienced was with like videos, like YouTube video. If I would hit play and then try to scroll down, it'll completely lag for like 30 seconds and won't do nothing. And the video is like the skip and they don't load fast but that just might be my computer so I mean leave comments and stuff tell me if that happens to you or is it just happening to me I don't know so just leave comments about that and I think that's about it thank you and have a good day